Hi everybody, look. John built this. Look at this piece of shit. It's not. It's Look lovely. Out. Okay, it doesn't make a huge amount of sense, but it like it takes Got full it. advantage of the fact that in this game, once you know how to manipulate it, this game does not give a flying flip about physics. Like you can just like hang buildings off the side of cliffs, so you can have really, really beautiful balconies and stuff. Take a look at your beautiful balcony. Yeah, it's really nice. It's, it's lovely. We've got the living area down here, and then we've got the sleeping and piano right. area. Up here. Look at that. That's a nice view, isn't it? It's a nice view. Piano. You can oh, see... Already why is there... Why is everything battered? Every single thing in this house. The posters, everything is battered in some way. Battered. Uh, admittedly, well, it is the post-apocalypse. It's, it's kind of thematic. Though I will say, the problem with, like, the new mountainous areas is... It makes you kind of... I think you realise the game's a bit smaller than it feels like when it's down on the ground. Like, when you're, down, when you're down low down in Fallout 76, it feels quite small. But then you look just, you know, you go up to a reasonably high spot and look out and realize, oh, so that's one side of the ash heap, and that's a different side of the ash heap. And, like, we're in the Savage Divide over here, and that's the entire forest over there. It's like, oh, this is actually, you know, quite a small game. It just doesn't you feel it when you're down you. on the ground. But actually, <laughs> for a game that's four times bigger than Fallout 4, it doesn't really feel that big. And 20 times emptier. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at my, look at me go, oh, oh, shit. But today, I'm today I'm going to take you on a nice little tour of the Savage Divide because my house is not actually where our house is. Our house is, yeah, over in the, uh, our house is over in the forest. This house is over in the Savage Divide, meaning there's a lot of really cool, pretty stuff for us to see around here. Hooray, pretty I've actually built this. Savage Divide. Actually, yeah, come down a bit, because I think that one of like, the prettiest areas in the whole game is located around here. So, I think if I recall correctly, you were interested in some kind of air station or something? I forget. I forget something Space about Space station. Space station, yes, that was the one. So, I, I, I think I can take you in that direction. I think I can take Let's you in that direction. Let's do it, bitch. Alright, fine. If I, okay, one thing I need to remember... Do you actually have power armor on you? Do you have power armor on you? Because there's going to be a lot of cliffs in no. this area. And, like, they're no. easier if you're wearing the thing that stops you dying from falling off cliffs. No, I'll work it out. I'll work out how to get down without falling. I'm, I'm actually right, a pro at not dying when I jump off cliffs. Fine, fine, so fine. Don't you worry. So, welcome to the Big, one bit of the green. game that's actually, like, nice and pretty and shit. What the fuck? There's grass! I know! It's like a proper, like, golf green and stuff. This is the White Springs. This, this is... Can I drive the go-kart? Uh, I don't believe you can because Bethesda don't believe in fun or interactivity. <laughs> Wait, no, cut that out. Cut that out. I think I'm not supposed to say that. <laughs> oh, no. John, John. Matt's going to have that three times. Uh, I don't believe you can because Bethesda don't believe in fun or interactivity. Bethesda don't believe in fun or interactivity. This, so, is, is this, is the white this is the white spray. This is the white spray. Yeah, sadly you can't do things like you know play on the tennis courts that are here, or play on the golf oh, course that's here, or why drive the golf course that's here. Ball? Like all the sorts of things that you'd think that would be really fun if you could do. Why can't you just drop a pool ball? Mm. Oh, because it goes in the fucking bags, don't they? Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. Thing number one this game needs, the ability to place items, at the bare minimum, just inside your base. By the way, um, yeah, some of the ghouls here are going to be high level, because I'm here. Sorry about that. It's, it's kind of my fault. I shot one. I, can't, I shot one and got 65 XP, so I'm alright with it. John! Yes? John, I found a skull! Look, can you see that skull? What? I'm following a skull. We can play golf with it. You're following a skull? I can't, I can't see the skull. Are you following a head that's rolling along the ground? A bit of a head, yeah. That only exists in your universe. It doesn't exist in mine. It, I can make it bleed. I can golf. You're get, you golf? actually is golfing golf? right now. Jeez. Fuck it, I'm going to golf. I'm well, the, green's in that, now, the green is in that direction, I think. I think you're going away from the green right now. The green is where oh, we came on. in. Shit. All right. Back. There we go. Avoid, avoid the trap, because this is like a pit trap right here. Yeah, avoiding that. I'm doing good. Where's the, where's the, so far, I'm on a par 45 or some shit. Par 45. All right. Where's the actual? Where's the actual hole here? Right. Which almost certainly doesn't exist as a hole. The hole here is not actually. It's not just a texture. There is actually some form of little kind of indent here. I think. 
And let's well, we're going to find out. There's actually a hole. I get this skull. Cap. There's a whole bit of the hole here. There's definitely... Or maybe there's not. Oh, it's coming back down. It's coming back down the hill. Oh. No. Stop. Oh, this is so hard because it's going uphill. Eh. I've got 12 shots on my tactical pipe pistol. I'm using this tactical pipe pistol to tactically get it up the hill. All right. Well, yeah, it looks like you're going to be able to get it yeah, up the slope at the bottom. Can you see minimum. the blood flying out of it? No, I don't see anything aside from just a bunch of... of because God, to it. me, you're just shooting the no. ground. So you're just creating a bunch of Come. like little dirt clouds. Cool. Oh, it was such a lovely day when we arrived as well. All right. I've put my main shot away. Here we go. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, that's a bad miss. Oh, hang on, oh, hang on. I'm going to be ready to celebrate here. I'm going to be ready to celebrate here. Where's press sparklers? Right, stop. It's right there. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Golf! No, fuck. Oh, I made a much bigger hole for it to go in. Shit. Shit. I'll, I'll expand the hole for you. Hang on. Thank you, John. Bigger hole. Bigger hole. Bigger hole. There you go. As long as you're like roughly in this sort of brown area, I think oh, that's Oh, oh, oh! Oh, it's so close now. Oh, it's got a silver fork in its skull. Oh, shit. If I pick that up, is that going to stop? I don't stop know. Existing? Possibly. It could do. All right. Final shot, then. I feel like that went in, but also missed. It's actually propped up against the hole. Okay, that's fine then. Oh, that's well, that's rolling away. That's definitely in. I did a golf. You did do did a it, golf. Did, 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 did. Matt will now count all of those shots that I fired and put on the screen how many shots that I did. Bearing in mind, you didn't Matt. even start the tee off. You started like halfway along. Yeah, also bear in mind that Matt probably just put swear words on the screen. Mm -hmm. Damn. Someone else lives here. That wasn't there a minute ago. There's somebody there. No, that's a rad. That, oh, that's, a oh, it is as well. We found a level a four. Disease? Yeah, no, that there's there's a rad stag in his house, but there's also a level forty six someone who who just lives here. It's quite a stag. nice. It was, it's just a nice place to live. It's kind of ruined it with all the stuff. I'm gonna wave hello just so he doesn't think we're sneaking up on him. I just want to have a look see what it's like. Okay, so he's actually built like his base on like the. Is this the tea off or is this like a different holes? Green, that's the term. It's quite nice, actually. The actual base bit of the base is a bit on the bare bone side. But I quite like how it's, yeah, he's actually got growing stuff on the green. I stole all the veg, Ron, John. Did Ron! You? I'm not sure if that's stealing. Is it? It's probably stealing. By the way, you're about to be killed by a zombie. So all I'm right. going to take care of that for you. There we go. I can do it. Boom, look at that. Hey, John, I've discovered the White Spring Golf Club. Have you? Well done. Yeah. It's Challenge large... him to a duel. I want to watch you fight him. Uh, okay. Well, disease feral go behind we you. We should. Okay. As a matter of politeness, what I'm going to do is I'm John. going to put one bullet John, in. There's a lot of... John, there's a lot. John. John, there's a lot. Of... Oh, you're, you're not wrong. Okay. Well, retreat John. to his base. Retreat to his John. base. There's defences. There's defences in his base. Retreat to that. I'm trying, John. John, they're in his base. <laughs> they're the smash the shell. Now, do not, whatever you do, don't actually... Oh, someone else is causing trouble as well. Um, someone else is... Uh-oh! Who did you... Who just attacked you? Someone just someone. attacked you. Oh, there's legendary no. charred ferals of level 62, which is not good from your point of view, actually. No. It's John, you know what? I'm finding it's not. John, you're wanted. Ooh, auto-stim level... Wait, why am I wanted? Oh, shit, am I? Oh, that's gonna make that's gonna make this episode a bit more interesting because now people are gonna want to come and claim that bounty. Um. Okay. I think it's because I must have. Acted. John, I wanted. You're also wanted. Okay, just hold on. I've just tossed grenades over there. There Ow, we go. Job, I got hit by a grenade. Now the downside is, uh, someone might try and claim our bounties. They can now fire on us at any point without any warning. It's like true PVP is actually on. I don't think you can actually do that, though. Oh, you just declared... Wait, why are you in red? Why are you in red to <laughs> me? You shouldn't be in red to me. I can't even target you with... I can't even... Ow! Oh, apparently... Ow! Oh. Ah, apparently teammates can claim each other's bounties. Right. So now you're dead. Uh, the slight problem is I'm now, yeah, very wanted.
And that probably means- Oh, the tur- Ah! Oh, shit, the turrets! The turrets have decided <laughs> I'm a bad man! Oh, bloody hell, the level 46 is coming for me now, is he? Okay, well, that's all fine. He wants to do that, does he? Okay, now he's hostile, um... Boom, boom, ah, boom. Darn it. There we go. I do drop a grenade when I die, by the way. Oh, well, cancer's just claimed 30 caps off me. I'm going to respawn by the, the White Spring Golf Club. Right, so this has started well. What happened there was a slight case of accidental fire. There was a small amount of accidental firing going on. Oh, there's more experience if your turrets destroy stuff. Uh, I think if you're there next to them, yes. Well, why don't we set up some solid turrets in like a really dangerous area? Uh oh. We could we could do uh, that. Babes. Don't worry, he's he's out of legs. He's out of legs. He's fine. Right. Yeah, you get a lot of experience just taking on ghouls in this sort of an area. There's that. See, there's... we should we should find a difficult area and just farm it. Yeah, but there's, there is an island called Deathclaw Island, you know. Okay, so my new plan. Yeah. Yeah, shot cans in the butt. Come we on, you. We should go visit a space station. Yeah. And then farm and then the space Island. station. Deathclaw Island. Deathclaw Island. I'm going to attack this fighting? guy. See if he's into it. Yeah, let's see if he's into it. Yeah. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Cant. Ah! Come on, Cant. Wait a second. I'm just gonna I'm gonna try and get in the way of his I'm just gonna try and get in the way of his hammer. Yep! Yeah. There we go! Got him! Yes! I got my money's back! Ha <laughs> ha! And now we get all his stuff. All his stuff. All his stuff. All his stuff. Ah! Oh, he's got me by the ball bag! Dan, let's get out of here because I just stole that guy's stuff, so he's gonna be really annoyed at us. Dan, we need to go. Dan. Okay. Dan, we Where'd need to start go? running. I'm going to suggest we start running uh, east. Run east. 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 I think east is a good idea. Anyway, east, east. We need to find a way like around these mountains because there's a really cool thing to the east of here. I think we should try to go and visit ahead of actually going and seeing the, uh, yeah, the space station. Cool. John, can I blow up the uh, sentry bar? No. If you decide to pick a fight with that thing, it's on your own damn head. Actually, I think it'll be on your own damn head. Whoops. There's there's an assault drone behind it, by the way. Is it technically Run, hostile? It's not hostile to me. Run, the game doesn't. Run, the, game, the game doesn't care. The game doesn't care that we're on the same team. As far as they're concerned, I'm not its enemy. It's just gonna. An assault drone is now chasing you down. By the way, they can run faster than you can. <laughs> yeah, but but can they? Oh, fuck. <laughs> if you're a next question, can they jump over, like, knee-high obstacles? No. No, they cannot. John, I've worked out a way of killing it. Yes. Is it staying the other side of a knee-high obstacle? It is. Okay, shall I help you out with this? Would be nice. I'm trying to shoot its combat inhibitor. No, don't do that. That'll make it go frenzied. Which doesn't help us, because there's nothing else for it to attack. I've shot its combat inhibitor. It's it now inhibited in its combat. No, that's not what co that's not what combat inhibiting means. It inhibits its ability to combat. No, it inhibits who it's combating. And right now, there's Why only it... us here. Why would it inhibit me and be on him? Done. Oh. Whew. Oh, I didn't even drop anything. That's a piece of shit, wasn't it? Right, follow me. We want to go this way. We want to go this way. To the north. We need to find a way to cut through the mountains to get through to the awesome thing. John, 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 look. Yes. John, John, what? John, John. What? I bet I can what? climb higher on this than you. You cannot climb what? this. Yes, you can. Watch, watch, watch. John, John, John. You do not understand the Bethesda engine as well as I do. One, and then, and then, and then. Shit. Okay, would you like to be able to climb that? Because there is one way we can actually make you do that. I'm not building a base here. No, no, no. It's not a base. How would you like to be able to jump super high? Yes. Come with me, Mr. Nerd Cubed. Come with me and I'll give you for springy legs. There's it's actually, really there's, okay, there's a really good spot just around here. I'm just going to gonna fast travel to a location. You can fast travel to me in a second. I'm just moving over there. Because what we need to do is we need to get you a mutation. 
I want to be mutated. Can I get like superpowers? Yes, pretty. Some of them actually pretty much yes. So what I'm last forever. Uh, okay, so I've just moved just north. Oh, I should be yeah. just north of you on the map right now. In an area called uh, Blackwater Mine. Blackwater? Oh, shit. I think it's Blackwater Mine or Black Black Gulch Water or, or Black Red Dead Redemption. I forget. It, it's called something anyway. It, it's Got called... Got the black in it. Okay, so Hello. let's talk Hello. about Hello. this area because this area over here has got a couple of very useful things if we actually go in the mine over here that's in like the shed at the end with this here robot and, and stuff. John, I'm looking around the place. I'm exploring. I'm falling. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you're fallouting right now. Yeah. I'm done. It's important I'm done you hoover up all the shit first. Very important. I agree. Uh, so we head into the mine right here. There's a couple of very uh, useful things. Yes. Uh, what's this? What's what? What's this big wing sticking through the floor? <laughs> it's it's a ceiling. Oh, a big wing. A disease scorch beast. Oh, it's a, it's a scorch beast just crash landed. Sometimes they just do that. If someone else just kills one. Or sometimes they just seem to oh, drop out the ground. One time I was there. just running along and a scorch beast literally just flopped dead in front of us. It's like, where did you come from? This is not <laughs> the first time that's happened. Sometimes the final boss just appears in front of you dead. Oh, wow. <laughs> High quality. <laughs> Yeah, it's just you a know, big it's, dead it's like it's like how the sometimes in New Vegas you're just wandering around outside Nipson and Linnaeus's body just drops out the sky. It's like, oh fuck, it's Linnaeus. John, Where do you not see this big fucking wing just right here? What in, inside this room? Yeah. No, I cannot see a massive fucking wing you, in this room. Can you see him on the roof? Hang on, can you see? He's over there. He's on the roof. He's on the roof. Yeah, he's down the roof. I cannot see anything. Come back. I cannot see a giant come scorch on this way, come beast. This way. Look, he's there. He's there. No, he only exists in your universe. <laughs> he's not there. Not for me. It's all right. Look, we need to mutate you into a kangaroo. Okay. All right. Fine. So, the reason why this is the reason why this is like the best mutation place in the game is because it's got two really important things, which is, it's got a way to get rid of your rads with this thing, we've got ourselves an actual decontamination arch. You need to just push this button and you can get rid of absolutely all of your rads if that's what you want to do. So if you get a mutation you don't want, you can Ow. clear it by just, yeah, it does you a tiny bit of damage too, but it's barely any. Um, so you can get rid of your mutations by walking through that. But you also want to get mutations. Now, where's the nearest set of... There's no rad barrels here. But there's, I think there's like a super radioactive cavern just down over here somewhere. So I'm just going to finish off the glowing mole rats for you right now. There's still one in here. Hang about, hang about. Behind you! Vats is fucking useless. <laughs> I keep Dead. going vats by instinct and it's just not useful. So uh, this room over here that's like got the barrels in front of it is stupid radioactive. Like stupidly large amounts of rads in here. So just stand in the middle of the room. Yeah. And you'll probably start picking up, there we go, 28 rads or so. So now we just stand in here until you pick up some form of mutation. And I've mutated to become a herbivore. Uh, so I've become a vegetarian due to exposure to radiation, <laughs> which I don't want. So I'm going to go over and now clear the mutation. And I'm going to then go back to the room and try and get a different, better one. Like not becoming a vegetarian. I don't uh, know how I t to say which one I got. It says radiation is giving you mutation. Oh, uh, if it doesn't say on effect. screen on the text, then go over to your Pip Boy, and then it's listed in effects under stats. The stat tab, the effects tab will tell you what it Empath. actually is. Empath. Empath. That's something That's to do with teams. That's damage isn't it? taken. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've got empathy because of radiation. Yeah, you picked it. John, I don't think Bethesda know how radiation works. But so, well, the one you're looking for is marsupial. Marsupials. That's the one that gives you stupid high jumping abilities. That basically you just become Spider-Man, but Fallout. Spider-Man, but Fallout. Yeah, you can like you can get to all like basically you can just break the game. You can get up to all these areas. The game doesn't seem to expect you to be able to get up to, despite the fact the game contains a mutation that lets you get up to them. Oh, I got super radiated. I think. Yeah, I think if you just see, like, glowing eyes, that just means you are highly irradiated right now. Oh, 75 rads! Jesus! 
Yeah, there's there's a lot of rads in this sort of that an seems area. To be completely random how many rads you get. Oh, 88, 89. I died running out of the area because the the rads are lagging. <laughs> oh yeah, and if you die from uh, rads, then you properly you 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 can't be kind of revived. I'm ra I'm rad rad sick. The radiation sick. I'm thinking there might be a cooldown on mutations where after you get one, the game says you can't have another one for a while. Which I didn't know about, but I think it might be the case. Maybe if I... If I leave the session, then reload into the session, I'll be allowed to pick up a new mutation. Alright, case... this is getting too grindy and bold. I'm going to a space station. This is far All as right. I, I'm too joy. I'm going to leave the set. I'm like, no, this isn't the game. This isn't fun. Fine, on we go. We are not a kangaroo. We tried our best, but all we did was become empathetic and, and also a vegetarian. <laughs> we tried to become a kangaroo, but we became vegetarian instead. <laughs> Do you remember the animated series of The Mask back from many years ago? Yes. Where they, the two guys tried to basically turn themselves into awesome supervillains of radiation and one of them just became a fish. He became fish guy. Yes. That's us, that is. <laughs> we have just basically tried to become super powered. Ah! And instead... Ah! We... Ah! Okay, now it's here. Now it's here, yes. <laughs> I've found it now. Now it's appeared. Where is it for you? It's, it's, it's wing is sticking through... It's sticking through that, that wall over there. Next to the robot. It's next to the robot. Oh, okay. For me, it's actual fucking face is here. <laughs> like, it's just in the corner crouching to jump out at new players. Got myself a marker that I want now. Lovely. In fact, you might actually like this location for building. I've got an alternative to show you that we're going to pass by. So, the thing hey, that's over here... The thing that's okay. over here that's actually quite nice is... A Reveal. That thing big over there. Satellite dish. That's yeah. a big fucking satellite dish. Yeah. Big satellite dish. And I thought it might be big enough. Like, one thing I've always wanted to try and do is, like, if you were allowed to build close by to it, could you actually get on top of the dish? Because there's no way to get on top of the dish normally. Yes. So yes, I was... We will, we will do that. I mean, you, you studied, like, science... So, like, what's that I second started, dish on top science. of the dish? That dish on top of the dish, that's what they're listening for. They just built it too far away, and they had to build yeah, it to hear it. This is how they get TV illegally. Like, this is kind of why I thought it would be useful to... Hello, that. Okay, we can stay away from the super mutants, because we need to be on this side anyway. Because, like, my thought was, because, like, the distance you're allowed to build things is a certain distance away from the center of an area, the actual lip of the dish is a very far distance away from the center. So mm. it's possible we might be able to build something, which again, with the assistance of the marsupial perk, which I was hoping one of us would get, we might be able to get up on top of the dish. Well, why don't you try and build a base here and just go up with ladders? Let's just see if it's gonna, if it's gonna let. And then get up with ladders up there Let's see if we can get up there with ladders, and then another person builds their base on the other side, which should be far away enough. Oh shit, that's interesting. I'm just not sure if it's going to let you ever build a base on top of the big dish, though, because that will be centered. And it's well, if they've got if they've got their blocked out areas, Bethesda's probably put it at the very bottom where they've attached it to the floor. So yeah. there's a chance it might be high enough <laughs> that it can build it's there. It's possible. Uh, I'm not seeing a place to put down the base right now, though. Can you see any place to put down the base? I feel like if you could just get a camp down somewhere around here on the hills or something, that might be acceptable. It might be possible. But Bethesda sometimes seem like they're opposed to the concept of fun. So they might basically have just drawn a massive, massive line around this area saying, no, you may not build here. No one may get up on top of the, the giant fun thing. How dare you even suggest it? How dare you suggest the concept of fun? I think they have as well. I think they've drawn a ridiculously massive... I can't... Okay, over here. There's... All the way over here. All the way over flipping here. Never going to be able to make it over to that. Because there's no way in this game to, like, glide or anything. There's no gliding. If only this was Fortnite. Hmm. Do you have a... 
Have they got rid of the commands in this? The what? <laughs> the, just as a question, does the old does the old like you push the button and then type in TGM and get God mode? That, that yeah, because off, this right? is now because this is now an online game. You cannot do that. Have you checked? <laughs> Just TCL honestly, at the moment. I, just honestly, TCL. it wouldn't actually surprise me if you just tried it and it worked. I genuinely wouldn't be surprised. No, no, Fun's not there. Oh, I must have patched it out. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, I fell down a cliff. Oh, it's okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. It's so fine. fucking hilarious. Just, oh, I'll just TCL up there. What are they hiding up there? Why would they not allow you to get up there? I mean, surely they're going to know. The, the moment anyone sees that, they're going to be, I want to get on top of that thing. Because yeah, it's a high up thing, and thus I want it. to climb it. Yeah, a lot of people want to get on top of a thing. You know what that means? There's a lot of people in one area that's uh, the fun, immersive gameplay, emerging gameplay that they're going for. You know what people would do if there's a post-apocalyptic thing? They'd probably build in areas. They'd, yeah, they'd like, say, an area things. where there was a giant bit of cover so they were protected from rain, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. That would probably be a really logical place for them to build, yes. I understand why there have to be restrictions that you're not allowed to build around, say, plot-critical areas. Because people are yeah. going to need to come in and use them, and someone could just, like, wall them in and be a dick about it. And then try and defend them with, like, loads of turrets or whatever, and that would be bad. But I don't understand why areas that are purely aesthetic and are not used for any meaningful plots, even if they were even used, like, used for, like, daily plots, I don't understand why we can't build around them. And thus, like, modify them and make them more interesting for people that discovered them after us. Maybe this big satellite dish moves at some point. Well, I've done the quest. That, I've done the quest that brings you back here. And I've never... And I didn't do... And they didn't do anything there. I think there might be something else here, like a daily quest or something. Because there was, um... Yeah, there was... Like, I saw someone go into the basement to do something on a terminal I didn't have the password for. So there might be something. I'm trying to break it, yeah. <sighs> just want to build. What else can I build? Okay. What else is super awesome around here that you might be allowed to build close by to? Where's this fucking space station? Just let's just go there. Let's just teleport there. Fuck it. Fine. I'm taking you to the space station. It's it's up north. It's gonna cost me money to travel there. But fuck it. Whatever. Fuck it indeed, sir. Fuck it indeed. Look at this lovely view that you can't build shit all on. It's so... Why would you not be allowed to build on not main plot critical areas, Bethesda? Come on! Because they might add a thing that does this... Here's the thing, okay. They've created this architecture that doesn't actually do anything and isn't interactive. But, like, surely then the one way to make it interesting and interactive is to not provide a way to get to the top so people want to build a way to the top. Yep. That's the one thing that'd be good for. Like, the first time I saw that and realised there wasn't a stairwell to get to the top, I thought, okay, so you can build a base there. And I'm inside my own face! Oh, no, that's your face. Sorry. Cool. Yeah. Oh, Spaceship. I was expecting something a lot smaller than this. It looks a bit radiated around here. Uh, surprisingly not. As long as you stay out of the water, you'll be fine. Oh, good. Right here, right here, right here, we've got a big crashed wall of it. Why the fuck are we not just building a base inside this? Uh, I'm assuming we're not allowed, right? We might need to build it a bit more distance. Oh, fuck, you're kidding me. Uh, not allowed to build, 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 not allowed to build. Why would you have this then? Um, so I'm up on this rock over here. Um, you're not allowed to build here. But you are allowed to build just a little bit further back. So you're allowed to build as long as you're not in sight of the space station, basically. I mean, okay, if you were start yeah, if you were if you had your base here, you'd be allowed to build up to the cliff that overlooks the space station. So you can have a base that like overlooks the space station, but you may not touch the space station. The space station is too good for the likes of you plebs. Uh-huh. I honestly, I, I, I'd not tested this before. I just kind of assumed that, like, you wouldn't be able to build by the middle of the space station. But, like, the areas over here by the outskirts, you, you'd be able to. You'd actually be allowed. I was thinking you could build here because you could, that bit's clearly there to be included in your building. Yeah. And it's quite oh, a distance I can't away even from... walk this way. It just says you cannot go this way. Oh, you found the edge of the map? Yeah. 
Oh, I didn't know the edge of the map was that close to this bit of the world. It's just here. You can't... I can't build here. I can't go here. Yeah, Bethesda have always had trouble not really knowing how to disguise the edge of the world. It's been it's always been very easy in their games to accidentally just hit the edge of the world without meaning to. Whereas Obsidian were much better at very gently and organically curving the world around. So you just found yourself being gently turned around. So you didn't realise you just hit the edge of the world because the game very organically shifted you around a bit. I want to build... Ugh, we can you build way. up there? Can you build up there at all? Yeah, here-ish. You can get just about a view of the space station, but I don't know if you, I wanted to build in the space station. My issue is, here is the end of the world, so I need to... Hang on, by that tree. Yeah. So I want to make sure that we actually could build everything in the area anyway. Oh, there'll be plenty of space. If you kind of... If you lay the camp down about here, I think we might be able to just... Just fit inside. Oh, I can go here. Oh, oh! Oh, there's a little bug area here. Fucking Oh, ice. lovely. Do it. Do it. Slap it down. There's one pixel of loveliness here. I can see if I can get it. There you go. Yes! <laughs> we've done it. We've broken Fallout 76. We can get... We can get hang, so what's our, what's our build radius then? Hang on. Uh, okay. It looks like we would be able to build inside this building. Uh, we need to go outside the build radius to get inside it. But then we can get back in after... Oh. Ah, the problem is we can't put down stairs. We can't put down stairs. That I'm inside lets... it, John. Huh? I'm inside how... it. <laughs> how'd, you, how'd you get inside it? Did you just drop There's in another... from above? There's another door, John. What? Side, side entrance, John. Side entrance. Oh, there's a door, is there? Yeah. I, I slightly miss. I slightly missed the door. See, the, the build line is right... It runs along yeah. here. Yeah, it's right there. I see it, yeah. Uh, it's just... I wanted to include this door... Fuck, I'm going to try and move it, even though it's... See if you can just move it too. slightly, just a little bit, little bit further. I think you're going to struggle to move it much more. I think you've done pretty well just to get it, like, including, like, any form of asset, quite frankly. <laughs> like, I think at this point, you've already... Basically, there's someone already in Bethesda, their spider sense is tingling. Nerve! Someone is using some of our assets to have fun on their own terms! How? Bring the servers yeah. offline! Bring them offline! Patch the game immediately! Alright, I'm going to try and hit that doorway on this side, maybe. I'll we'll start trying to put camp down in here. I've mm. decided to say fuck it. Let's just get as close as possible. Oh, uh, you're not. I don't think you're going to be able to pull that off. Unless you just, again, happen to find an exact... Hey, Dan. Dan, 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 Dan. Check me out. What? what? Oh, you're a space person. Yeah, I'm, uh, yeah be, uh, there's even better news than that. There's much, there's much better news than that. Which is... Uh, if you just check the little bag at my feet. <coughs> I can't see a little bag at your feet. Neither can I. Come to the... I think it's dropped out of the world. To got you your own space suit and space helmet, and it's just fallen out of the universe. I think it just have just fallen through the floor. There's only two in this area. <laughs> Those were the only two space suits. Now only I get to go to space. Dad, Dad, come back. I'm going to drink the water until I die. No, Dad, stop. It's just not I worth it I'll anymore, give you John. my spacesuit. I've got another no. one back home. No. It's fine. I don't need it. It's going to take it's you gonna quite drink a while. The water. It's going to take I'm you quite drink the water while. and die. Sadly, I'm perfectly safe from the rads on account of the spacesuit that I'm wearing. Oh which God. I can't believe it just fell out of the world. It's so a angry. special, unique asset. It's the one reward you get for coming to this place. It's the one reward. And it just it just fell out of the world. Goodbye, get everybody. It for you as a present. In the next episode, we'll just be somewhere nice and we'll build a thing and everything will be good. But for yeah, today... Yeah, we'll build a thing. We're going to build yeah. a thing. Today for I now, I think... I think Dan's... Yeah, that's... That's pretty dead right there. What if he had any good stuff on him?